Baobab Batik is a wonderful company. Its products are simply stunning. And this is where they're handmade, at this workshop here in Swaziland in Southern Africa. Here the emphasis is on working hard and having fun at the same time. We are making genuine batiks, meaning that we apply melted wax on fabrics. It's a great example of a social enterprise putting its employees, most of whom are women, first. And it's typical of the companies Tradecraft works with. Beobab Batik reinvests 50% of its profits back into the business and its people. In Swaziland, the level of poverty is high and many women are bringing up large families alone. Unemployment is a massive problem and healthcare can be very basic or non-existent. We've done quite a different thing here with having a family. You need to be feeling safe and happy when you work. And if you do so, then you make great things. This is Shiza Kelly, who's been working for Beba Batik for 10 years. She's risen through the ranks to the position of quality controller. Every item leaving the workshop comes under her watchful eye. I really appreciate to be at Bioba Batik. I've got five kids and all of them they are at school because of farm working here. It's impossible to overestimate how important this job is to her. She's single, one of her five children is disabled, and she's also looking after her elderly mum. I would be very, very poor if Bayobad Batik didn't have the job for me. Because I'm what I am today because of Bayobad Batik. Bayobad Batik ensures its employees are looked after in so many different ways. This year we have offered uh, and uh, cancer checkups for our staff. We have done first aid courses for everyone and uh, self-defense courses. Women in general need to be able to, to protect themselves. Coming to the workshop here, you have quite a long way to walk. And also, especially in winter, you walk in the dark, which in any part of the world is not advisable. Um, so we thought, let's give them some tools to if something happens, at least they have some training in how to, to deal with that. So what, what sort of things were you taught? We were taught about to hide our things, then to, to make noise when someone comes. Like, we, you have, we have learned that when someone comes, it comes and yeah! <laughs> She's a Kelly, it's all about providing for her children. They're proud of their mum because they know when they say, Mommy, can we have this? I try by all means to make for them. They are, they are my first, first priority in life. Whatever I've done, I, my kids are the first priority. Tradecraft works with many companies like Beabab Batik. Support us and show you care. You can order by phone, by post, online at tradecraftshop.co.uk or through your local fair trader or tradecraft stockist. Thank you. <laughs>